I have a little story time to tell you guys. Southwest lost our luggage. Now we gotta wait for you to go all the way back up. Tell the people what happened. This is a beautiful thing because we're going on a four day cruise. Without luggage, huh? Without luggage. They, yeah. they lost our luggage. They lost <laughs> They weren't sure if it was like, you know, transferred to another airplane or if they just like forgotten BWI, which is where it came from. So what they told us was, well, there's nothing we can do at this moment for you guys. If you want to go to your cruise, I would, you know, advise you to go now. Otherwise, you're going to lose your cruise plus your luggages. And uh, when I look at them, I was like, uh, honey, I don't know if you understand the situation, but everything, like everything that we need it's in that luggage. I think the only thing I had in my backpack was my camera. Thank goodness I brought it. My camera and uh, I think a pair of sneakers, a pair of sandals, and uh, to have my situation three underwears. That was all. And the only reason why I put in that backpack is because um, my luggage was overweight just because I'm actually going to get a new suitcase because for some reason the bottom of my suitcase is already heavy so anything you put even if it is not even if it's just a little bit it's already going to make heavy so I transferred those shoes to my backpack and the rest are checked out yeah that's basically all we had my husband didn't have anything so for the first two days so the first day on the, on the cruise you know we uh, leave at 4 p.m. and then the second day we stay all day in the sea so for those two days we didn't have anything to wear like anything i was wearing my same white dress with flowers like for two days no shame about it uh we tried to actually find clothes to buy in here but unfortunately all they have is diamonds like literally like i was like what there's no bathing suit there's no dress there's nothing that could help our situation so they did have plenty of diamonds though probably because the fact that they don't have taxes um you know on the seat and in here in Bahamas so I'm, I'm assuming that's why they have so much diamonds that's the chance for them to sell it but anyway we didn't have anything my husband actually was able to get a pair of shorts for me they didn't have any bottom at all so all I could do was you know wear the same dress and keep you know changing on to wear it is what it is but fortunately when we got to Bahamas I was able to you know buy a couple clothes including this one right here I was able to get two rumpers um, it's a type of it's like soft pants and uh, shorts and I got like three pairs of bikini just for the fact I was like I want to have like options just in case who knows and my husband got some stuff for himself too he basically just got like a bathing suit shorts or whatever but the trip was amazing we were able to you know even though it was hot super hot we still were able to do some shopping we were also able to enjoy some Bahamas breakfast which was delicious you know we sat on the balcony you could see uh, the strip right there people you know just doing shopping it was kind of fun it was about the same price as if I was buying in America like you know a romper was like $25 um, the bikini was not so bad one star I got a bikini for $20 and the other one uh, the other side right across the street was basically $15 a pair so I got like three we were able to do that and then we went to the beach and we got like some chairs and we were able to enjoy the beach which was pretty fun and now I can enjoy actually Freeport a little bit so I'm gonna end up putting the videos of Bahamas mostly from Freeport because the other one I have videos I'm gonna to try to basically put on this vlog as well but they are made with my phone because like I say everything that I had is in the other suitcase so I was not able like to you know vlog properly whatever but you still can sit a little bit around so I'm gonna show you guys a little bit of a room and don't mind me it's a little bit messy in here but as you guys can see we are at Freeport right now. This is not actually the nicer side of it. You guys can see right here. That's Freeport. I'm sorry if it is too noisy. Boats. Port right here. We decided to get a balcony. It's not like that big, but it's the ocean view uh, suite. And here is our room. It is messy, we do not have the room service yet because we haven't left the boat yet for Freeport. So, hello there. It's a little bit messy, you have a pull-up couch, 
on TV. They had the three uh, Corsi bottles, or however, complementary bottles. They had like three complementary bottles, or water bottles. And then here's the other mirror, and that's the outfit that I got from Bahamas. As you guys can see, it's a little romper and the braid too. As you guys can see, can get it. I'm gonna turn around. So, and the braid as well. It was made in Bahamas by you know Bahama lady, and I like it. You know, we can do like a ponytail, or whatever. Forgive me, I don't have makeup, and I look crazy right now. But here's a bathroom and then we got a little jacuzzi in here there's nothing like huge or whatever as you guys can see my swimming suit hanging in there and I'm gonna try to make a video too from um, the rest of the cruise including the pool and all that but for right now that's it and I will talk to you guys soon thank you bye And they can put it down. White boys, if you got some rhythm and you can put it down, damn it, make some noise! <laughs> 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 it's time to get out of this boat. Oh, it's the fun. <laughs>